Hey guys, Magnus Robert here, bringing you another video on another dead Walking Dead character. This time we will be looking at the Oceanside fighter Beatrice. Beatrice is of course female, she is played by Brianna Venkus, and in one episode she is played by a stand-in called Justine Davis. She is early to mid-30s and first appeared in Swear. Before the outbreak, not much is known about her apart from she lived with her husband. After the outbreak began, she eventually joined a group led by Natanya and her family. Soon, the saviors tried subjugating them, and Beatrice and her fellow survivors were forced to gather supplies for the saviors. Soon, Beatrice and her fellow survivors decided to rebel, but Simon and his men stopped their rebellion and killed every man and boy over ten. Justin, a savior, killed Beatrice's husband. Beatrice and her group then moved to the Oceanside in order to get away from the group that was terrorising them. Beatrice and her group were very hostile to any survivor who entered their community from then on. In Season 7, Tara enters the Oceanside community and Beatrice, along with Kathy, tries to capture Tara. But Tara gets the upper hand and Tara knocks her out. But she doesn't kill Beatrice. When she could have. When Tara is captured, they decide not to kill her for this fact and instead tie her up. Beatrice, Kathy and Natanya question Tara. The women have dinner with Tara and beg her to stay in the community, but she refuses. Tara reveals the slaughter of the saviors at the satellite outpost, and presumably Natanya tells Kathy and Beatrice to kill Tara. The next day, Kathy and Beatrice lead Tara outside the community. Tara understands what is actually going to happen, and she re runs to flee. Beatrice finds Tara and holds her at gunpoint. She then reveals everything she went through with the saviors. Cindy knocks out Beatrice and flees with Tara. Later, Beatrice and Kathy find Cindy on the bridge and lead her away back to the community. In the following weeks, Tara returns to take the community's guns. Bombs go off and Kathy and Beatrice run to the armory, but they are stopped by Jesus and Daryl and forced to tie themselves up. And they are brought to the other residence. When Natanya and the group talk about fighting the saviors, Beatrice seems interested in this. And when a small herd arrives, she helps take out the herd. Beatrice then watches the group leave with her community's weapons. In season 8, Beatrice runs to Natanya after she is shot and killed by Enid. She surrounds Enid and Aaron with her fellow Oceansiders and captures the two. Beatrice suggests to Cindy that they kill the two, but Cindy decides to let them live, but refuses to fight the saviors. Beatrice and some others return from fishing one day and watch as Aaron barely kills walkers. Beatrice tells them to get a drink. Beatrice and the others then find an exhausted Aaron a few hours later, or days later, who begs them to fight and not be afraid. In the finale, they at some point decided to fight and Beatrice and some others throw firebombs at the saviors as they try to attack the hilltop. In season 9, Beatrice moves to a camp at the bridge to help fix the bridge. Beatrice and Kathy get guns from Rosita and she is the first to help when a herd attacks the lumberyard. Later that night, Beatrice and some others ambush Justin, take him to their former community and Beatrice kills Justin as revenge for her husband. Beatrice watches as the saviors backlash over the death of Justin before anything happens. Rick arrives to stop it. Beatrice and her crew eventually kidnap a rat. Beatrice pretends to be unconscious in the woods when Rick and co arrive. That night, Maggie and Daryl show up at a rat's execution. Beatrice tells them about killing Justin, and then she watches as a rat is killed. Beatrice sits at camp smoking when Jed arrives at the camp at gunpoint. She stands by Carol when gunshots are fired. Beatrice survives, but her good friend Kathy does not. Beatrice may have also helped kill Norris. Beatrice then helps some others try to save Rick on the bridge, but when he shoots the Dynamite, she, wa she watches in horror as he kind of blows up. She also is present in Rick's hallucinations in that episode. In between season 9 and 10, Beatrice remained with the Oceanside. Eventually, she decided to help the others with the Whisperer problem, and she travelled to the hospital in season 10. She agrees to help a small group, including Daryl and Carol, to travel through the herd to lead a wagon away to help hopefully get the herd led to the ocean. She gets up and heads into said herd. As they begin to leave, Beatrice notices a Whisperer with a knife out. Beatrice is attacked by said Whisperer, but Carol stabs that Whisperer in the gut. But the skin wearer wasn't quite dead. And the Whisperer does this to Beatrice. <laughs> Beatrice is slowly and gruesomely devoured by walkers. There is likely not enough left of her to turn. 
Beatrice was a decent minor slash background character. She has been on and off the show for quite a while, and it would have been awesome to see some more of her, but whatever. She evolved quite a bit. She started off as someone scared of any conflict to a cold-blooded killer, going against her community's wishes, to someone who is willing to risk her life to help those fellow survivors and communities. Anyway, that is it for Beatrice. Tell me your thoughts on her character, and I shall see you in the next video. Goodbye.